Hello everyone, it's Anne here from Anne Makes. Welcome and thank you for stopping by. Today I have another Dollarama haul to share with you. That's right, I've been to Dollarama several times. I actually did haul, make some really huge, big hauls at a couple Dollaramas and I had to separate those because otherwise the videos would be way too long. So here I have a Dollarama haul that I did. I that was it. Oh, it was just a few days ago, actually. It was a few days ago. I had to go into Ottawa, and I stopped at a Dollarama I had not been to before in uh, on 10th Line near Innes, and I just never been in that store before. I never had the opportunity, so I stopped in, and I found some things that I hadn't seen in my other stores. So, the first thing I found was this artistic student work surface this and of course look at that it's in that lovely fuchsia pink uh, that might not be some people's color but it's perfect for this room it's perfect for me and I I love buying mats to protect the my work surf my tables and desks when I'm working on something so uh, it's really nice that I can get these at Dollarama and change them out whenever they come out with a new style. So these are 17 by 22 inches. It says approximate size or 43 by 56 centimeters. Uh, it says it can be used as a cutting board, a placemat for arts and crafts, homework, scrapbooking, painting, student work, work surface, protects table or desk, durable non-toxic material easy cleanup washable surface so the price on this was two dollars and that's what i was charged and i it's all wrapped and i got to the cash and it was two dollars and it's all wrapped and i just thought wow this is a nice thick mat full disclosure here i've had this for a few days now and now that i look at it I think there was a mistake because I see that once I take off this plastic, which I will do right now, this is not one big thick mat. No, it isn't. It's actually one, two, three, Four, five, five cutting surfaces, five mats. Now, the thing is, this was not the only package I saw there. There were several, and I just thought they were one thick mat. I'm not disappointed though, because this will be perfect to use on my island, especially when I have friends coming over and we can all have a nice pink mat and it will just look really nice and tidy and everyone can have their work surface and what I love about this this is thicker than the other ones I have and the other ones I have are so grungy and oh my goodness I really need to toss them so it's really nice for me to have some new ones these are thicker and what is nice about these is that you can actually you know lift these up so if you're working, let's say, on a, a scrapbook layout and it, you, you need something to dry but you want to keep working on something else, you can just lift this whole thing, move it, and, you know, go work on something else while the project that's here is drying. So, uh, yeah, I'm all for that. This was $2. There's five of these mats in this package. I don't know if it was a mistake. I don't know if that's, they're intended to be sold like that, but it seems like such a, too good a deal. But that's what I got charged. So, got this. So I was happy to find that in the store, but I'm even happier now that I've opened it to see that I actually have more for my money than I thought. Another item that I picked up at this Dollarama, I hadn't seen this at my stores in, in my area, is this big accessory organizer I've seen smaller ones smaller versions and I have one in my closet but this is much larger and I thought oh this will be perfect I can put a lot of scarves on here instead of having a couple smaller ones and maybe I can 
uh, move, use the smaller ones for jewelry now. So I got this, this big dress form accessory organizer. Uh, there's 16 sections for your accessories. And they show here that they hang jewelry and scarves and, and whatnot. So this will be great for me and my, uh, my closet. Um, I love that it's pink. And this was $4. So I think this is a really nice find and a good price because I know that if I go to home stands, whereas we can find stuff like that, it'll be more. And yeah, so yeah. I'm, I'm good with four bucks, you know. <laughs> All right. So a couple other things I picked up. I had been looking for some more wood, fake wood contact paper in my area and my stores were out. So I found a couple rolls at this store. So I got them and these are $1.25. And it's 18 inches wide, I think. I can never see this so yeah it's 18 inches wide by 40 inches long so this is what I was looking for for some projects that I want to make so I got that this dollarama ha still had the garden camp nitro gloves which are turning out to be a really good buy so since they still had some I picked up three packages because I uh, definitely can use these not only in my garden, but uh, I can use these in my craft room when I'm working with ink. So very nice to have and I can throw these out when I'm done. And uh, you get two pairs in here and I believe this was $1.25 for two pairs. So I hope that with six pairs, I'll be good for a few months. Boy, this is a fun new item that they have at Dollarama. Uh, it's by Crafts. It's an LED string light uh, garland and it's a painted project. Get this. It's little uh, thin wood birdhouses that you assemble and paint. And they, the instructions are on the back. Let me show you here. It comes in several pieces and you get the little lights and you, uh, they recommend, you know, painting them, decorating each little house and then you can hang these and isn't that cute like if you have farmhouse decor style that's really really cute so you get 10 you get 10 led lights so in total there's 71 pieces because i think there's how many houses are there i'm not sure how many houses there are in the kit i hope there's 10 houses and it does require two AA batteries. And um, build and paint your own birdhouse. Each little house measures about two and a quarter inches. And I'll open it up to see what you get in here. So it doesn't say how long it measures when it's open. But you get a string of 10 LED lights. So here's the little, so you get these two sheets of these little wooden birdhouses so you just punch them out like the wooden puzzles so there's two four six eight ten so there's twenty oh so yes that means there's ten birdhouses so you do get the supplies to make ten tiny little birdhouses look how cute these are so you get all the pieces and oh if you're lucky they forgot they left the hearts in some of these and you'll have extra little chipboard pieces how cute is that <laughs> and you have the LED lights and the little battery pack that's attached so you just need to put the two AA batteries in there 
and you've got this cute you can make this garland so these are four dollars a piece and i bought two because i did not know how long it was and since this this dollarama is far further from where i usually go i thought i might not have the opportunity to go back there so i picked up two and at this dollarama they had some uh, really cute children's books and I got them just mostly for the artwork. Um, these are classic, the classics illustrated junior. And so, and this is the 50th anniversary edition. Retail regular $4.99. And if I remember correctly, so regular retail price was $4.99 for these little books. And at Dollarama, they are being sold for $1.50 each. So this is a series of books that had been uh, written. And were they illustrated? Written Albert Lewis Cantor. Um, classics was it? Uh, so anyway, so this there's a series of these little books with some like uh, classic stories and with illustrations so kind of, kind of comic book style very uh, old style very vintage looking and so I just thought these were really cute and there's a dollar fifty so I got the ugly duckling uh, Pinocchio the tinderbox Cinderella the the original Cinderella <laughs> Not the uh, Walt Disney one. Beauty and the Beast. Original. Not the Disney version. Again. Uh, Wizard of Oz. And we have Paul Bunyan. And, oh, no, I have two more. Goldilocks and the Three Bears. And finally, the Magic Pitcher. So I just thought... I would like to have these and I may keep these for some paper crafting or I might just keep these in my collection I'm not sure but uh, I will go through them and I just thought for a dollar fifty they are very sweet uh, they are the old style of children's books and I just thought it was a good deal I found the polymer clay. I had one of my viewers, and I'm sorry, I don't remember who it was right now. I'm just terrible remembering things on the spot. Uh, who told me that she had found oven baking clay. And I'm saying polymer clay. I haven't checked if it's polymer clay. Oven baking clay. And uh, I was like, I have never seen that at my Dollarama. And, well, I found it at this Dollarama. So what a good deal. You get four colors of this oven baking clay for a dollar fifty. Go buy oven baking clay uh, at a craft supply store and you're gonna pay more than that for one block sometimes. So uh, I, I got one of each that they had. So they have this one with the brown and a black. Uh, and they have pink, these these shades of pink here, purpley, the blues, some purples or uh, lilacs or lavenders, some greens, and I guess this would be the yellows, the more or yellow oranges. So I was really pleased to find those. I do already have a lot of oven baking clay in my stash, but I got these because I thought the price was phenomenal and I'll just add this to my uh, stash of oven baking clay. And now some other craft goodies that I had not seen at my stores are these metallic markers. These are relatively new to Dollarama, and you get a gold and a silver in this. There's not much more information on here, and yeah, so I will be trying these. There's two in here for $1.50, 
And oh, I picked up another light box because they had quite a few at this store. And I just <clears throat> thought I would start using more of these when I'm filming videos. Uh, well, maybe. So, and these are four dollars. My goodness, what a good deal! I saw how much I saw these at Michael's. I can't remember how much they were, but they weren't four dollars. And another craft supply. Never saw this at any other Dollarama. They have a set of 18 watercolor pencils. Never saw that before, and I have no idea uh, what the quality is. I'm not expecting much I, out of the studio brand, but I've been surprised before, so I could be wrong. And so these are $4. So $4 for 18 watercolor pencils. While I was there, I also found oh this these which I've hauled before but I hadn't seen them in a very long time in my stores. These are the wreath hangers. These are magnetic hooks. These are perfect for my metal doors. They just stick to the metal doors and I can hang uh, wreaths and decorations for the different seasons. These are two dollars a piece. So I picked up four of these. Yes, I think I picked up four of these. That was the intention. So hopefully with the ones I already have, I will have enough now. Because I do find these hard to find. And especially in white. I have white doors, so I really prefer to use the white hooks. And uh, let's see. Oh, I picked up this. This is random, but I did not see this at other stores. This is a Global Beauty Care product. It is a silicone applicator apparently intended for when you are applying a facial mask. Uh, this was, so this, this applicator brush, uh, well, silicone applicator, mask applicator brush thingy is $4. So, but it, these are really nice products. So, and I know in the drugstore. Things like that are much more. So, and oh, I found some charcoal infused body washcloths by Spa Expressions. They're infused with charcoal. I guess these are excellent for exfoliating. I, I don't know. I haven't tried them yet, but these are a dollar fifty. There were only two, so I got both. Uh, I thought I would try one out, and maybe I'll keep one for you know, a stocking stuffer. And speaking of stocking stuffers, I got some stuff for the guys. I got these nail brushes to wash, you know, clean their, when they wash their hands, get off all that grime, clean under their nails. And these are the Ace brand and they're black. I just thought, well, these are very nice. And um, so I got them each one and they're not cheap. They are $3 a piece, but I'm pretty sure they would be more in another store. Plus this is intended to be a stocking stuffer. So that should be okay. And then I saw this <laughs> and this is a rock candy. That's what the brand is. Uh, USB wall charger. These are blue and they come in this funny little case and it says uh, also works with Nintendo DS systems. So basically it's just a little USB charger to plug in the wall but it's like this uh, shiny electric blue thing and it comes in this little case and they are, these are $3 a piece and I had seen the, the same ones at uh, my Dollarama but I think they were pink or orange and I thought oh it's too bad they don't have blue and then I saw these these this store only had blue ones so I thought oh this is perfect for my guys so uh, I got these for stocking stuffers and I have a few more things to show you I picked up a couple rolls of this decorative mesh from simple style you get you get a lot on here for your money you get 10 yards it's 21 inches wide you get 10 yards of this mesh 
and I got this I got two rolls of this in black because I got two rolls of this in black for a Halloween DIY I have in mind so yeah that's where I got this you know come to think of it this was not the same Dollarama this was another Dollarama um, but it's all in the same bag for some reason okay uh, so these are some Rama Design slide off cookie sheets. So they're the ones that have a little like lip here for uh, like a handle, but they're flat. So these are great for sliding off your cookies. I'm I'm tired of using the other sheets that I have that have a little edge. Sometimes that that doesn't make for a perfect cookie. So um, and these are the non-stick kind, and so you can get. A large one like this for four dollars they also had a smaller one a smaller version uh, but it was also four dollars but um, I got two of these larger ones for four dollars and I also got to go with that a spatula a nylon cookie spatula and this is two dollars and fifty cents and it also a rama design so we bake cookies every week here so um i just thought these would be nice to have because the cookie sheets we have now are dingy looking and oh i saw these i'd seen them before and i didn't pay attention but i picked them up finally these are four dollars these are fit circuit uh, two mixer bottles, uh, great for nutrition shakes and smoothies. So there's a thingy in here that it's like a ball or something. It's really, I can't show it to you, but they show it a design here on the side. So apparently you put your, your smoothie or protein shake or whatever in here and you can shake it when that little device in there helps to shake everything up. Um, so I got this because uh, my husband and my son really like to have these smoothies and protein shakes and all that. So I thought maybe they would like having these and the two of these are $4. And frankly, I'm, I find that some of the current reusable uh, beverage containers that they are using are dingy and need to be tossed so some new ones wouldn't hurt and last but not least i saw this in the card section and i had to get them <laughs> so they're just some beautiful greeting cards they are uh, the hallmark ones these are a dollar a dollarama and look at the beautiful beautiful cat so i got this mostly because of the kitty a black kitty on the pumpkins and uh, I would I had I brought I bought several of these so I could give them to friends but I think I want to keep one just because it has a black kitty and that is it for this Dollarama haul actually it's not I also purchased this anti-fatigue floor mat for three dollars I hope you enjoyed that. I hope you're inspired to make some of your own DIYs with uh, my own suggestions here. Uh, please like, thumbs, give it a thumbs up if you liked it also. Uh, give me a comment. Please share the video. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not already subscribed. Uh, and stay tuned for more videos of hauls and DIYs and how-tos. I've got lots of videos lined up. And it just takes a while to upload them to YouTube. So, uh, yeah. So stay tuned for that. Thank you so very much for watching and for supporting this channel. I really appreciate it. Take care of yourself, stay crafty, and I'll see you after the next video. Bye.